वेलकम टू नीला चिल किचन दिस इज मंजरी टुडे वी आर मेकिंग एकादशी स्पेशल चीज केक दिस इज न्यूयॉर्क स्टाइल एंड बेग चीज केक वी विल बी ऑल्सो टॉपिंग इट विद ब्लूबेरी कॉम्पोर्ट सब्सक्राइब टू माई चैनल फॉर मोर सच रेसिपीज So first in a bowl, take two cups of almond flour. You can also use um, almonds and walnuts mix as well. Add half cup of powdered sugar, four tablespoon of melted butter. Add half teaspoon of vanilla extract or cinnamon powder. You can choose the flavoring you like. Mix well. You can see it forms crumble-like texture. The crust is ready. Using a 10-inch spring foam pan, I'm reversing the plate and then adding it. So you can do the same, or if not, you can add a parchment paper and then close this. Now cover this pan with aluminium foil. Now add the crust layer. I'm going to use potato masher to line this nicely. This is an important step otherwise this gets mixed up with the cheesecake layer and we don't want that. So our bottom layer is ready. We will bake this for 15 minutes in 330 Fahrenheit or 165 Celsius. Now in a pan add 2 cups of blueberries, add 2 tablespoons of water. bring this to a boil in high flame you can see it starts boiling switch to medium low flame once it's cooked well add 1/4 cup of sugar mix well continue to boil till the sugar melts and also cook till your desired consistency after around 5 to 7 minutes You can switch off the flame. Our blueberry compote is ready. You can transfer it in a container and keep it. Now in a bowl, take two cream cheese packs. Now whip this well. add half cup of heavy whipping cream with this well as well now add 1 cup of sour cream or hunker add 1 can of condensed milk it's around 40 nos half cup of powdered sugar and 1 tablespoon of tapioca starch since i'm making grain free gluten free i'm using tapioca starch with this well So this is ready. I'm going to add some flavoring. For that, use a zest of one lemon. This also helps in digesting the cheesecake. So transfer it to the cheesecake layer. Now 
add two tablespoon of lemon juice or juice of one lemon optionally also one teaspoon of vanilla extract read the ingredients of all the items that we are using to make sure it is grain free and gluten free just mix this well so our cheesecake layer is ready as well now take a baking tray and add water basically we will bake this in a water bath add this spring foam pan on top of it add the cheesecake layer make sure the crust layer has cooled down before adding the cheesecake layer now bake this for 40 to 50 minutes in 330 fahrenheit or 165 celsius after around 40 to 50 minutes of baking you can see it's not sticking and it's smooth from the top we will allow this to cool in the room temperature and refrigerate after that you can also cool overnight so after overnight cooling in the refrigerator use a knife to slide through the edges for easy removal if you don't want to wait overnight you can also use freezer one hour so remove the outside covering of the pan so you can see our cheesecake is nicely done I'm going to cut a slice and show. You can top it with anything you like, any berries. I'm using blueberry compote that we made. Our New York style cheesecake is ready to offer. Serve with prayer and gratitude. If you like this recipe please like share and subscribe thank you for watching our video